So yeah, um, YouTube. Actually, no. Let me let me be specific in this addressing. Um, people who make copyright claims on my video, even though I use music that I find free on the internet, if you could just stop, that'd be great. So, for other version of YouTube, regular YouTube, like my subscribers YouTube and potential subscribers YouTube, how y'all doing? It's your girl D, back with another video, like I wouldn't be. Live swatches today. Live lipstick swatches. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six of the new Melted Matte. We also have another liquid lipstick from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And just for kicks and giggles, a lip gloss that I'm wearing right now. This is actually the new MAC lip glass for Dej Loaf. And this is a very chocolate and brown girl friendly color. It's very basic, neutral. You could play it up with a lip liner um, or keep it simple. You could layer it on a little thicker if you want. You can keep it just as a very thin layer, just add some shimmer. Normally, I don't mess with MAC because they are very good about getting, you know, celebrities on board for a particular or a signature shade. I've got the Ariana Viva Glam. I've got several other MAC shades as well, too. But I've been stuck on these melted mattes, which is why I apparently bought six of them. I have a grand total of eight. I think they have like 23 shades. One of them is a Sephora VIB exclusive. Like, unless you've spent as much money as Sephora as I have, you can't get this shit. So I'm going to tell you about it and make you feel good. Without further ado, assisting me today per usual with our liquid mattes is our Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Lip Saver Lip Primer. Anytime that you are wearing a melted, or melted, anytime that you are wearing any kind of liquid lipstick or a matte lipstick, you definitely want to ensure that your regular lips are protected. Always exfoliate them mugs first and foremost. You don't want little dead flakes of colorful skin popping up in the middle of the day and then you have a chunk of color missing and you're looking wondering what the hell is going on. Like why do I just have pink everywhere but right here? So we're not gonna talk about what it is that I had to do for one of these shades at 1030 at night though. If you're on Snapchat, you know. And yes, it was worth it. So, um, yeah, so this is the MAC Lip Glass, again, Dej Loaf, and let's get started. Uh, we are going to go in the order of not Too Faced to Too Faced, so. I really like this. I really did. It had a nice shimmer to it. It's one of those where I'll keep it at, my, at the bottom of my purse. I need something to wear immediately. So. For first up, we have Anastasia Liquid Lipstick. This is in the shade Potion. I also have the Lip Gloss Potion as well too. And I believe I picked this one up maybe? Where did I pick this one up? I think I picked this one up at the Sephora VIB sale kind of a uh, bluish blueberry purple I like it mm-hmm you know what I'm um, for the sake of time I'm not even going to make a comment about being a creep like I usually do. Whenever I insert uh, the wand back into the tube. So, potion. I like this. I like this very much. This very well could go with the look that I have right now. And 
it's also after midnight so I've preserved my makeup as much as possible it's coming off here so so yeah I like this all right uh, still for video mmm 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 I like that YouTube do you like that YouTube I like that YouTube so kind of nasty. I like that. Do you like that? I like that. Okay, I am a creep. Alright, so I'm here for Anastasia. This is my first liquid lipstick of hers though. Uh I'm not um I've got a couple glosses, but this is the first actual lipstick of hers that I've gotten. Because I know that, um, I think Sephora was kind of holding out, or Sephora was, ooh, that's really not all. Mm -hmm. Okay. I know that, uh, like for some contractual issues, that the full Bobby Sweet wasn't available in stores or something like that. IDK. Alright, so we did Anastasia. We did the Dej Loaf. Now we're on the Too Faced. Okay. So, first up, the one that I had to go through um, a little bit of difficulty to get. I don't have the pretty box because I've already worn it. This is Melted Matte. One of the Melted Mattes by Too Faced. This color is Bend and Snap. Like, um, when I think of Bend and Snap, I think of the hood, like, wait, look, wait, 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 and, uh, you know, one of those. Like, throw it up. That's what I think of Bend and Snap, you know, like, lean with a rock with it. I'm sure that Jared Blandino had something different in mind when he imagined this. That's fine, babe. You know, you can come on over. We'll show you how to lean with a rock with it. Snap your fingers, do your step. You can do it all by yourself. Now, for those who saw me wear this the other day, y'all know I detest with a passion bright colors. I am a chocolate girl. I like my deep, dark, vampy, emotional, angry, you look like I wanna, or I look like I wanna take your soul, emo kind of colors. This is not me, this is foreign. But when I wore it, and I also featured this one in a tutorial. Everybody loved it. It said it's a great color for spring. That, um, you know, it does complement. I don't know, maybe I am doing something right. Now, the brighter colors, you definitely need two coats and as with um, a lot of matte lipsticks or at least a lot of liquid lipsticks you want to start off with a liner too just for kicks and giggles I've got one I'm just really tired because it's after midnight but hey who knows so yeah Bend and snap. Alright, got the stills for the video. Mm. Like I said, I can't, I'm not a fan of bright. Y'all are. No. So, but um, bend and snap. I think I got this one directly from Too Faced because Sephora had the liquid or had the melted mattes first. And then 
when Sephora online sold out, they had like six of them in the store. And then when they didn't have them in the store no more, or maybe they do, I just haven't been. Um, then Too Faced finally released them on their website. So I've actually done quite a, I've actually done quite a bit of searching in creating my little collection, even though my little collection is not a big collection. For one single brand though, and especially with these being like, what, $22 each? Mm. That's another thing that I hate about these. They stain. Usually I have to skip days in between wearing them. Because I look so crazy. Or... I have to wear another lipstick. In between. Mm. Mm. All right, so this one I just got in the mail today. I saw Jackie Iana wear this one and she was talking about how this color looks so great on so many different skin tones. This is Who's Zooming Who? And it is literal blueberry. Like that one little spoiled bitch from Willy Wonka and how she blew up and got swole and was rolled away because she had a golden ticket. But Charlie and Willy Wonka wasn't fucking with her. That kind of blueberry. You don't even need two coats for so this one. Looks so tired. I've been up all day. I was up all night editing. That's okay. I like this one. This is one of those that like um, I kissed a Smurf and I liked it. My boyfriend don't mind it. It's one of those kind of uh, colors. Remove it. If we just want to put some more lipstick over, I don't care. I know I got some kind of cleansing oil. It probably would make some kind of difference. A cleansing oil definitely makes a difference. Oh my goodness. Well, that was gonna be some stain. I would have to use wipe after wipe after wipe and who's not about that life at 12, 26 a.m. is me. So yeah, um, next color. I have not tried this on at all. I saw it online. Actually, no, Sierra got this in store and Sierra looks good with anything because she's that perfect shade of mocha chocolate. And even though I love all chocolate girls and I think that we're all family and wonderful and empowered and should stay with one another or stick with one another. Um, you see this shit? You know what this color is called? Lady balls. 
Look here, Jerry Blandino. You know what? You know what we gonna do? You know what we gonna do though? But you know what we gonna do though? Like, do you know what we gonna do? All right, primed. <laughs> we gonna use a lip liner. That's what we gonna do. Mm-hmm. We gonna use a lip liner for this one. Blend in Smith's mascara. Mascara. Foundation. Hello. Diana's tire. Just so we don't mess this up. Because this is one of those where you don't want to mess this up. Let's see what we got. You know what this looks like? Nail polish. Sally Hansen. Like my mama had this shade on her toes. Piece of lint on this thing. I just opened it up. Now, come on now, Jerry Blandino. Shit. So, one more coat for fun. For the video still. Um, Y'all, I don't, I don't do red. I don't like. Nope. Mm -mm. Uh. Uh. No. Nah. I mean, I'll wear it, but I'll probably wear it with like a black liner instead. Cause, ooh. Oh, um, shout out to the Supreme Cleansing Oil. Cause this stuff saved me. Yalla, saved my life. Mm, this is one of those where I gotta have like automatic 24 seven resting bitch face. Like, I cannot smile with this because I look like a clown. Mm-mm. 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 I mean, I like it. I, lo I love these melted mattes and, you know, I wanted to get something that was out of my comfort zone, but mm-mm. 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 Hey. Have I said mm-mm enough for y'all? If I haven't, mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Oh my God, getting a cleansing oil was amazing instead of just using wipe after wipe. That's yeah, such a smart idea, Diana. Yay. All right, now on to shades I'm comfortable with, things I know. So I wore this one for the first time the other day and y'all liked it. This one is Unicorn. I got this at the VIB sale too. And I wore the, uh, you know, like I do a lot of Snapchatting and if you ever wanna follow me on Snapchat, you can. I just need to know who you are so that I'm not surprised because I'm quite uninhibited and I have no modesty and I have no decency 
and I'm very hilarious. So, uh, if you saw it on Snapchat, all y'all loved it. Oh my gosh. That little bit of cleansing oil and this, uh, Rainforest of the Sea. Mmm, yes, 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 Lord, yes, yes, yes. So this is one that, um, it's starting to get oily. Hang on. Okay. This is one that is outside of my comfort zone, but I enjoy. Now, personally, on anyone else, I think the shade would be bomb. Uh, especially a very, very dark chocolate girl. This is one of those that could, it could go either way. Like it might look good with a dark burgundy or a dark purple liner. Um, it might look good with a lipstick mixed over it as a base for something. I like it. I, I do have to admit, I like this one. I was a little skeptic about it first, but I do like this one. I think that this is a worthwhile investment. Uh, next up, the first, mm-hmm, resting bitch face. Let's not drop the compact now, Diana. No. Oh my gosh. Two more. Two more. Two. Then we are done. Yes, 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 yes. I do thoroughly enjoy this color. I do. Like, it's... It's sassy enough to where you could wear it all day. Like, go to work, wear it, make a little bit of a statement, definitely catch attention reapply hit the club i like it i do you know who it reminds me of tt blame it on quay on instagram <laughs> hang on let me see if i can do it right i so am going to find a picture of Quay making the TT face and do a side by side. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm tired. I don't know what it was for. It's okay. All right, so on to a couple colors that are not as vampy as I would prefer, but they'll do. So this one, I believe I did get at the VIB sale drop dead red did i get this at the vib sale did i talk about this one in a haul video what did i tell you i cannot remember mm. hello we're home This is definitely more me. More me personally. Mm-hmm. Yep, 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 yep. Um, I guess I could read the box. Matte color gets a melt over. Not a makeover, but a melt over because Jerry Blandino's marketing team has to be all about cute plays onward so our innovative formula glides over lips like a gloss but dries to an ultra matte opaque finish infused with a no sting melt no sting plumping filler melted matte ensures color always looks rich full and kissable never dry shriveled or cracked volume lip gives a plumping smoothing effect lightweight long wearing formula features avocado oil vitamin e and hyaluronic H-Y-A-L-U-R-O-N-I-C. Looks like hyaluronic filling spheres with an angled applicator, an angled applicator that allows for a precise application. Hashtag get melted. Hashtag Diana's tired. Okay, so 
I do enjoy this one. I really do. Like I said, this is one of those that is more me, more in the scheme of what it is that I wear. But also, I understand that I can't wear dark colors forever because everybody's going to think something's wrong with me. Like, there are a couple people that I um, see at our headquarters that specifically know if I'm wearing black lipstick to not approach me. I'm just, you know, just saying, like, I wear badass eyeliner and bold lips because I don't want you to talk to me. What sense does that make? Perfect sense in a makeup world. Uh, yeah. Alright. One more. One and done. The last one is the one that is the VIB exclusive shade because Sephora literally was sold out of every single other shade except this one because it was only available to VIB Rouges. So this is on point. I can make it to the end of the video. I can. Hmm. Now this one I'm a little undecided about. Y'all gonna deal with this sloppy application. Mm. Now this one I am a little undecided about. Because it's not quite at the vamp that I'm used to. It's not quite bright. But... It's, it's an interesting shade, you know? We've got... Like, how do you even describe the shade? Because it's not quite purple, it's not quite pink, it's not quite burgundy, it's not quite fuchsia. Actually, you know what? If they mixed fuchsia and black with a hint of gray and a touch of bitch who the fuck you think I am, I think that would be this color. Anyways, so I like this. I do. It's kind of a berry. We'll put it like that. It is kind of a berry color. Yeah, so that's all I got. Yeah, I'm very tired. So I got work in the morning and things, but I'm going to be an insomniac and get this video up and upload, get this video up and edited and uploaded or at least set to upload while I'm at work tomorrow. So yeah. Um, hmm. So, chocolate girls, I hope that you enjoy. Um, and if there's any other suggestions for other videos or products, let me know. Got another haul video coming soon because we cannot stay away. So yeah, any other uh, questions, concerns, ideas, suggestions, general praises, funny jokes, all that good positive stuff or whatever, hit me in the comments section. Please like, please subscribe. I always will follow back. Until then, I will see you in the next video.